Chelsea finally succumbed to their fate on Wednesday, taking the unwanted record of being the first defending champions to exit at the Champions League group stage. A 6-1 thrashing of Danish side Norseland, although impressive, could do nothing to save them. And it's been a quiet spell in the league. Three matches since Rafa Benitez took over and still no wins domestically. But the Spaniard is remarkably upbeat ahead of the Blues visit to Sunderland at the weekend. We were disappointed after the game because uh, we were out of the Champions League. But at the same time, we were really pleased with the performance. And today you could see the players and we were talking about the things that we were doing well. And it takes a long time because it was uh, a lot of positives the other day. So I think it has been very, very positive in terms of the, the mentality, the, the, the message that uh, we wanted to send across and how we wanted to play, how we wanted to do things. One person who finally did get the good night they were looking for was Fernando Torres. The notorious underperformer clinched two goals, putting to rest a 12-hour goal drought. Could this finally be the turning point for the Spaniard season? Yeah, I was working very hard and uh, the team as a team was uh, much better attacking and Fernando had more chances and he scored two goals and hopefully he will score more goals in the next uh, couple of games. I think he needed to score but uh, he needed to play well and if you are asking me he needs a couple of goals, I think that the, we need more goals from him, from Mata, from Hazard, from Oscar, all the offensive players, Victor, for his uh, confidence to score is fantastic but uh, for me the main thing is if he can be involved, he can play well and it will be also easier for his teammates and to score more goals. With John Terry out through injury, Benitez will be hoping that his luck might change with the help of his fellow Spaniard.